Hello everybody, my name is Timothy Trespass, and I am a targeted individual, uh, making this movie today, Tuesday, because yesterday we had the guy, the landlord guy, come and knock on the door and say, what are you doing, when are you going to get out, uh, you're not going to be out of here by the first, are you, what do you need, another month, uh, I don't know, I'm not going to give you another month, or maybe, I don't know, what are you going to do, how are you going to get out of here, blah, blah, blah. So then we went to call the power company and try to put the power into our name so we could have electricity for the next few days or the week or whatever till it finds because we can find another place to live and and you know use the drill to take our furniture apart and pack it and the landlord called the the power company and told them uh, I'm the landlord nobody's living in there turn off the power and don't let them turn it on. So now we can't even pay the past bill and have electricity here. This guy is dirty and mean and he's not playing by any rules other than his own and there's nothing we can do. And I'm just trying to get the fuck out of here. And we can't seem to find a place yet that we can afford. Uh, and uh, even if we did afford it, we don't have enough money now because of this putting me in jail, these people who accused me of beating them up for, <sighs> had me arrested and then I got very sick and I've been sick for two, three weeks and you know we were thinking of buying a camper but it looks like there's no freaking way we're going to afford, we can afford it, we can't come up with two, three thousand dollars, we don't even have twelve hundred to put a deposit on a room for six hundred a month if we could even find one, let alone pay the mover 500 bucks to, to pack and, you know, to help us move everything. We could pack it, but, you know, we're not too sick. i got to throw away most of what I have. Yes, sir. So, here we are, sitting here, waiting for the electricity to go off, wondering what the fuck are we going to do. You know, we can get candles and all, but, uh, you know, can't, we, we have no bathroom. We have no toilet, we have no water, we have no sink, now we'll have no lights, no whatever, and these people who have the keys to get here, and, and we can't, you know, one of us has to be here at all times, and we don't know what these people are going to do, and we just need to get out of here, and I'm calling every phone number I can find looking for a place to stay, I'm calling everybody with the campers trying to see if they'll lower the price, and every day that ticks by is more money that bleeds out of our pockets as we need to eat, and transportation, and everything else, and... You know, the few people that said they were going to help us, some of them said, Oh, I don't know, I can't help you if you're not going to buy a camper, uh, you know. So, it's like, it's like I have no friends anymore. I have no, f my family barely gives a shit about me to send me, uh, you know, a hundred dollars or, <laughs> it's like, uh, I would be dead if I had to rely on them. I can't seem to get disability because I'm a targeted individual, even though I'm clearly disabled. We're living off the love of a saint and, and the, the, you know, God's sustaining us. Uh, I hate to ask people because I know that everybody who watches these videos is just as screwed up as I am. Their lives are fucked. They're getting, you know, some of them are living out of cars and cardboard boxes and if anyone can help us, either they know someone in New York who has a room to rent, or a place they're not using, doubtful, or uh, they could send us a dollar or something through PayPal, you know, on my home page channel of this thing, there's a little link in the header, if not, uh, email me. Or you could send it to my address, timothytrespass at gmail.com through PayPal. Whatever, anything would help, you know. I, I don't expect much. I don't expect a huge outpouring of uh, of help, you know. Uh, I'll probably get more wonderful comments and a few prayers, and I thank you. Um, but I have to try. If there's anybody out there that can send us a couple of bucks, you know, it would really help. Every little bit helps, and... Uh, you know, the money we were counting on, the people promised they were going to send, now they're not going to send it. So, 
it's like, well, we'll help you, but only if you're going to do this thing. So we're like, listen, we're trying to do, I told them right from the start, we're trying to do whatever happens first. If we can find a room, if we can get a camper. I mean, I don't even have a license, you know? And, and uh, what are we going to do, buy a generator now? We don't have the money for this. I don't know. I don't know how we're going to take our furniture apart. These people are really, really working hard to hurt us. This is the tenth forced move in three years. We are quiet, we mind our business, we pay on time. You know, we're like the almost perfect tenants. The only thing is we want to be left alone. We want our privacy, you know? I don't understand why we're being tormented and tortured and neither does everybody else. So, this is my plea for help. If there's anybody that can help me, help us to get through this situation, bless you. If not, please say some prayers for us, and that helps too.